Um, near is in Mexico. No, not even close. He's in San Diego. No, he doesn't live in Tijuana. He lives in San Diego, I thought. Yeah, I don't think Nier lives in Tijuana. He speaks perfect English as well. Yeah, near San Diego. Yeah, shrimp code might be Tijuana. Whose box is this? Is this, um, Nier's, it looks like? Yeah, it doesn't look the same as Soto's. Yeah. Nice job, Robert. That's what I like about Shine's really nice. It's just all or nothing, kind of. I haven't heard him speak Spanish, so I can't speak for Spanish. That's why I only vouch for his English. Messes up the angle there. Nears up two uh, stocks against Soto. If we can carry this lead, it might be a juicy game one for him. It always feels good to get a free game off for him, someone as good as this. Gets down tilted. Oh man, three stocks to two. Man. Oh, are you talking about Gage? Yeah, Gage is super good, dude. He's like really good at melee. Honestly, I think he has um, a bigger chance. Bane isn't isn't that his, his tag change or, a change or something to Bane? Does he really, oh, like um, Zach, uh, um, did he used to be Sat Daddy or something? All right. Yeah, cause I know Zach. I'm not sure if it's the same Zach though. He's like really good. Because yeah, I don't know if we're talking about the same Zack, because it's a Zack that like beats, um, beats Santiago. <laughs> like that, like, uh, no, that beats Santiago, not is Santiago. That beats Santiago. Like, a guy who beats him. Is, it, is his name Zack Cook? Okay. Is it, is it the one? Let's see, up smash. Near ends game one with a call out up smash. No, no combo there. Just calls him out with it. Free for all. Three, two, one. Up to back throw. Oh no, he should have just up here. Even if he uh, ended up off stage, and if he got the reverse step box, it would have come out in his favor. No, so, you see, that's a bad habit. Um, to mix him up, he does um, double jump up B really fast, but what you should be doing is jump away up B. It gives you more space to work with and it's less risk if you get hit. Because you still have um, more space to recover from if you get hit while you're high. Yeah, jab, jab, up smash. Three stocks, three. Nier's actually been doing fairly well with his fox. I haven't seen this fox before. That's pretty good. Very patient. Giant jab up smash would have been nice there. I mean, the um, lazy jab up smash. Man, if he's doing shine cancels when he does these good shines, and he'd be getting some good mileage because shine jabs are, they can really mess up Pika. Because uh, one way Pika stays on the ground when he's getting jabbed is when he's on the ground when he's at too low percent, but if he's shining beforehand, he gets popped up in the air. It's easier to get the up smash. So it makes it come out, uh, so it makes it easier to get it. So if he does enough shine jabs, he can kill him even earlier. And connect the jab to the smash even, at even earlier strength than it's um, previously possible or easy. Oh no! Oh, he messes it up! So it catches him with an air. Who expects to roll in there? Oh, nice job going through the defenses. Jab, jab, down tilt, dare? Oh no, this should be it. 
Oh my gosh. So does got him off stage now. Goes to the downer, but he just misses. Back throw sends Soto off. He's got a, no ledge chop Nair. Nair is stronger, lasts a strong hitbox. It lasts longer. Up air? Yeah. Shine jab. Up smash. Laser jab, I mean. Laser jab up smash will end it. Wow, three stocks to one. Near to Soto. Wow, this is very unprecedented. I feel like Soto's definitely his favorite to win this, especially playing his Pico. Oh no, messes that up. Go for the dare. Oh no, go for the down smash. Maybe he wanted to drill on shield, I think. Oh yeah, that's tough. You can't follow him down there. Dude, Nier's amazing. But he's definitely dropped off the since that time, SKG. Soto's dropped off as well, but I think he's definitely more consistent. Like, near lost to Peiko today. No, I've been in the scene for quite a while, Brody. I've been here since like 2015, 2014. Yeah, he did. He used to be super good. That's why he plays anyone, because it's just that fun for him. But as I say that, Soto comes back from that three-stock deficit, bringing it back to 1-1. One, one. Now, is Nier going to stay Fox or is he going to change? Oh, staying Fox. He's having fun. I was at Snowstorm 1, yeah. First fair bear, nice. Single laser. Doesn't an edge guard him with that. Gets a dash attack. He doesn't go turn as often because everything's like 90 miles from him. Ooh, nice up smash. Yeah, Nier's extremely good. He definitely knows the game really well. Like, he understands what works and what doesn't, and what to do in most situations. Nair follows him, tries to go for the double jump up air, it doesn't quite work. But he still gets him off stage and edge guards him. I feel like Nier's only disadvantage is geographic location. If he lived somewhere like uh, New York, I think he'd be an amazing player. Nice weight on that with the shine, but it doesn't quite work out for him. Gets him with a dash attack, nice. I'm surprised he got that shield out, I didn't see that coming. No, you see, you, gotta, you can't keep doing that, you gotta jump away. You can't just keep jumping forward and just up being when you realize they're getting too close. Man, why don't these guys get coaching? I wanna, I wanna coach Nero on that right after this. I wanna see him do good. I wanna see him get peeked by his palms. Right now it's possible. And back air stage spiking him right at the end. Soto goes up 2 1 against Nier. Nier changing. Probably gonna go Mario.
Yeah, kind of. So Nier joined Mario is shorter now. Nier's Mario is definitely a force to be reckoned with. He's very good at gimping. He has really good down airs. Especially off stage. Nair's out of the up air chain. Man, yeah, I should down beat before the double jump there. It doesn't matter about who he thinks he should go. It matters about what he's gonna have fun with. He doesn't care if one's gonna win or over another. He wants to have fun. He wants to play the most fun character. He doesn't care about the chance of winning. Because in his mind, the most fun is the best to play. Uh, back air. Oh, down B's out. Oh, it doesn't matter. He still gets shark. And now he's out of down B. Yeah, that's it. Man, Soda's up two stocks against Nier. Nier's winner stock. Soda be going straight to the finals, I believe, if he wins this. So this is round two. In top eight. This is winner semis. If Soda wins this, he's top three. That's nuts. Who did near beat winners? Does anyone know? Here's Kirby better than his Pika. Ooh, nice. Pika's pretty good, it's around Soda's level I'd say, but his Kirby's definitely really, like, way better. Like, for his top tier pickup, like, if he has the highest chance to be someone, I think his Kirby is definitely the way to go. Oh wait, I forgot Soto, um, played Bard in that match for, um, yeah, it's just winner's quarters. Okay, I was thinking, like, um, Soto advanced to winner's semis after being barred, but that was still in D1. 